Hi everyone, welcome back. So someone just left an Xenothreat Idris at Avras Harbor and the hangar door of this Idris is open. So I'm going to make a short video on what will fit the Idris. But this is going to be an unofficial one. When the Idris gets released into our hands, I'll be making a official one of what will fit. So here we go. So the first ship I'm going to be testing is this Aegis Eclipse. Oh, I think it fits. Wow, this gives me Star War vibes. Feels like I'm landing a ship on a Star Destroyer, a little Star Destroyer. So the Aegis Eclipse definitely fits. I'm going to move in a little bit. Oh, this fits very well. Once we have our own Idris, these boxes is going to be moved. So all the hangar is going to be cleared. And we can fit a lot of Eclipse in the Idris. My goodness. Let me see how many. One. Up to here is two. Up to here is four. I think we can fit at least four Eclipse inside the Idris. And this one is a Firebird. So the second ship, I won't be testing, but the second ship is a Firebird. This is someone else's ship. Oh, look at the Eclipse from the window. It looks awesome. Alpha One, you're cleared for launch. Go, go, go. Okay, next ship I'm trying is the Scorpius. Can we fit the Scorpius inside the Idris? Oh, we can fit the Scorpius in the Idris. Fits so well. Let's see. One here. Yep. We definitely can fit three Scorpiuses inside the Idris. Trying to get this Firebird outside the hangar. This is a disaster. No, I don't want to launch a torpedo. What the? What what is going on? My torpedo. <laughs> what? My oh okay. <laughs> All right, now let's try the Hornets. This is a F seven A Hornet Mark One, and of course this ship is gonna fit very well in the Idris. Look at that. And this one is the F7A Hornet Mark II, the tip of the wing. There we go. Wow, fits so well. I think we can fit at least three Hornets in here. Maybe four. And when you look at the ship from the upper deck, this really feels like a Battlestar Galactica. I really can't wait for this ship to get released. All right, Launch Vipers! All green, let's go! Oh, maybe not. Okay, let's try again. Launch Vipers. Let's go. Oh, I did it. Okay, now let's try the Saber. This is the Saber Comet. Oh, fits very well. I don't have to retract landing gear. Wow, so nice. At least three or four Sabers you can fit in here. All right, Saber One. You're clear for launch. Go, go, go. Ah! Didn't make it out. Now, a million dollar question is, will this Idris fit this F7C Lightning? Wow, it fits. Well, don't worry about the new paint. As long as it fits. It fits very well, actually. We can fit another, at least three F8C Lightning in here. So much room. All right, Lightning One, launch. Go, go, go. Oh, at least I launched. And it's worth it. Next one, will the Vanguards fit the Idris? Let's see. Go, go, go. Oh. Oh, I don't think so. Wait. Wait a second. 
You gotta be kidding me. Okay, retract landing gear, let's see. Oh, retract landing gear, the wing is blocking. Oh! You gotta be kidding me! The Vanguard fit the Idris! It actually fits very well. You can fit at least two vanguards here. Wait, I think three vanguards you can fit in here. That's insane. Okay, now let's see if I can get the ship out of the ship. It's the turret, top turret that's uh, blocking. Yeah, without these boxes and now these destroyed ship parts, I think we can get the ship in and out of the Idris. Quite easily, maybe. Yep, there we go. Getting out. Oh! <laughs> Worth it. Okay, this is the Envil Gladiator. The mini bomber. I'm pretty sure this will fit. Yes, this one fits very well. You can put uh, three or four of this uh, little small torpedo ship. There is a little traffic at the door. Get out of my way. Out. Next ship is the Glaive. This is also a heavy fighter. Ooh, look at the shadow on the Idris. Really nice. Okay, I think this ship will fit as well, but let's try it. Yes, it fits. Ooh. I don't think we can... Uh, Extend landing gear inside the hangar. Let me see. Yep. It's uh, caused some problems here. If it weren't for these boxes on the hangar, I think we can actually fly out a lot of ships. These boxes are blocking the path. Fly out, extend landing gear, and then take off. Nice! Love it. Now I'm gonna try the Mantis. Will the Mantis fit the Idris? Fly in. Extend landing gear. Wow, the Mantis fits Idris very well. Look at that. You can fit at least two, maybe three Mantises in here. I'll take this one. What? And then Tails is still on board. Mantis one launch. Oh, nice launch. Next ship. Will the Terrapin fit the Idris? Ooh. No way. Okay, landing gear down. <laughs> Amazing. Terrapin not only fits the Idris, you can fit a couple Terrapins in here. Yeah, it's those boxes that's blocking the pass. Yes, Terrapin was launched! Nice! Next ship, the Nomad. Oh. Please proceed to assign landing bay. Okay, the Nomad might have little problems. Yeah, because the... Revlav thing is uh, up in the air, so it could cause some problems. Let's move forward a little bit. Okay, lower landing gear. Put the ship down. Yes, it fits very well. The Nomad. You can put uh, two to three Nomads here. Landing gear retracted. Let's go. Oh! Yes, yes, launched! Next ship, will the Inferno fit the Idris? Oh. Oh, I don't think the Inferno will fit the Idris. Yeah, the wings are too wide. You know what? Let's repair it and try again. My Inferno just blew up. Let's try the Ion. Oh, yeah, the wings are too wide. 
No, it doesn't fit. This is the first ship that we tried. I tried so far. That doesn't fit the Idris. Ah, shame on you, Ares. Let me try sideways. No way! Sideways fits? Oh. I wouldn't call it fit. Oh, shame on you, Ares. Alright, ban you defender. Yeah, even so, my Banyu Defender managed to to squeeze in. Oh, this is cool. Okay. My goodness, Banyu Defender fits here very well. Awesome. Another ship that fits the Idris. All right, Banyu One, launch. Oh, it's good launch! Next ship, will the Argo SRV fit the Idris? Okay, before we do that, let's clean up these things. Oh, there we go. Let's do some uh, clean up. No way! Oh, I got stuck. Oh, I think uh, it barely fits. Yeah, if you don't use your landing gear, it will fit. But if you put your landing gear up, the tractor beam in the back is gonna go through the ceiling. But it won't be stable. Landing gear down. Oh, it actually fits even with landing gear down. My goodness, this is awesome. But it will be very hard to get out. So when you want to get out, just uh, strip up and retract your landing gear and then you can fly out the SRV from your Idris so let's try it SRV well launch uh, it's not a smooth launch but yeah those boxes is blocking the way oh yes SRV well launched nice next can you put a Sentoki eye in your Idris Oh, yes you can, but you can't stop the ship. Why I can't stop the ship? Oh, there we go, stopped. Yes, you can put a Sentoki eye inside your Idris. You can put a two or three Sentoki eyes inside your Idris. Okay, Sentoki eye, launch. Go, go, go. Launched. Next ship, can you put the Drake Vulture inside the Idris? Wait. Wait, wait, wait. No way. You can put a Drake Vulture inside your Idris? Wow, maybe you can put two. No way, this looks awesome. We can use the Idris to do so many things. I definitely will put a couple vouchers in my Idris. You can put at least two vouchers in here. Maybe plus a fighter. Voucher one. Launch! Oh! This is a smooth launch! Nice! Okay, let's try an origin ship. This is a 350R. I'm pretty sure it will fit, but well, let's just uh, try it out. Oh yeah, that fits so well. All right, 350R launch. Oh, this is nice. Ooh, next ship, the Prospector. Yeah, I apologize for messing up with the pads over here. It's full of ships. I can't help it. I have to test this out. This is a very rare opportunity. Permission to dock with the mothership. Permission granted. Wow. Oh, this is so nice. We can fit at least three Prospector in the Idris. Alright, Prospector 1, launch. Let's go! 
Oh, nice! I tried. The next ship is a Cutlass Black, but I really doubt it that the Cutlass Black will fit Idris. We will need the Kraken for this. But let's try it anyway. Ooh. Nope, I don't think so. Oh. Yeah, I don't think so. It will not fit the Cutlass Black. The last ship we're going to try is the Gladius. We all know that the Gladius will fit the Idris, but this is such an iconic thing to do, so we have to do this ship. So this is the Gladius. Docking with the Idris. Gladius 1, come home. Oh, this is nice. We have to do this. Gladius 1, launch! <gasps> oh, that is awesome. My goodness. Wow. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I survived. This is so cool. I gotta have to do that again. Oh! Never mind. Oh no! 30k! Well, even though the server 30k, but we are able to test as many ships as possible using this rare opportunity. So, whoever left the uh, Idris here, thank you so much for making this video possible. And I hope you guys liked it. When the Idris gets released, I will be doing another official what will fit the Idris video. And let's hope the Idris will get released sooner than we expected. Thanks for watching guys. See you in the next one.